Yaya, the giant panda that spent 20 years in the U.S., returned to her birthplace, the Beijing Zoo, on Monday. This came after she completed one month of quarantine in Shanghai, where she was cared for by specialists from the zoo. For months, Yaya's well-being has been closely followed by panda lovers, and now that she's safely back home, many visitors gathered at the zoo, hoping to see her amongst other pandas. I learned yesterday that Yaya will be transferred here, but we don't know which area will be designated for her. I came here first thing in the morning to see what the zoo has prepared for Yaya's new home. I saw a video this morning showing Yaya surrounded by bamboo, clearly enjoying her food. The Beijing Zoo says that Yaya is in stable health. In anticipation of her homecoming, the zoo has not only prepared a special feeding area, but also developed a tailored medical and nutritional program for her. For 22-year-old Yaya, however, giving her time to adjust to her new home is the number one priority, so she won't be on display at the moment. Nonetheless, the people I talked to said that as long as Yaya lives healthily, it doesn't matter whether she meets the public. <laughs> Excessive human presence might have a negative impact on Yaya, so I think keeping her off display is a way to protect her. After all, she is an older panda. We just want her to enjoy her golden years. Whether in their homeland or abroad, active or dormant, exhibited or not, one thing remains certain: the love for these furry creatures shows no signs of waning.